It may look like a shaky first step, but for Michel Rocati, it is absolutely life-changing, not to mention a worldwide first. Five years ago, he was in a motorcycle accident. It completely severed his spinal cord, leaving him paralyzed. But now he's walking again, thanks to a nerve stimulation device that sends pulses to the brain and muscles. Researchers at the Swiss Federal Institute of Technology joined forces with a Dutch tech company to create a six centimeter spinal implant. Just hours after insertion, Michel and the two other paraplegics in the study could stand. But the device, which is controlled by a touchscreen tablet, does take time to get used to. The more they train, the more they start building muscles and the more fluid it becomes and they understand what they have to do and they learn to work with this technology. The device does not repair spinal cord injuries. It stimulates damaged nerves that otherwise weren't able to send strong enough messages to the brain. And it's allowed the three participants to walk, swim, bike, and climb stairs. And if the findings prove correct in peer review, it could be a breakthrough for paraplegics. In about a year, we will start a pivotal clinical trial, primarily in the U.S., in order to test this technology in a large number of individuals, probably up to 70 to 100 individuals. For Michel Rocati, being able to cross a bridge, let alone stand on his own two feet and look someone in the eye, they have been huge steps forward. A miracle of sorts, <laughs> yeah. thanks to science and technology.